Hello guys, InnovantX welcomes you on a platform TBT task based training where you can explore many of the embedded systems. First of all, congratulations to all of you for completion of your task 1 successfully. Now we are moving towards our second task that is make a security system for a museum. In this task you are going to use many of the sensor. In this module, we are going to give a brief knowledge about tilt sensor. I have made a default circuit from Arduino board and a breadboard. I have connected power supply and ground to the breadboard from Arduino. Now quickly search TILT tilt in your component list search bar. You can see over here there are two sensors that is tilt sensor with two terminals and tilt sensor with four pins. We are going to use tilt sensor SW200D. Here you can see that this sensor is having two terminals, the terminal 1 on the left side and terminal 2 on the right hand side. The name of this tilt sensor is SW200D. Basically what this tilt sensor is. So the introduction part of the tilt sensor is SW200D is a dual ball type Signal direction tilt sensitive trigger switch. It is commonly used in automation devices. When the device tilts to a conductive terminal that is terminal 1 by more than 10 degree, it will be at an open circuit that is off state. And when it is horizontally position changes, the terminal trigger pin that is pin number 2 is tilted more than 10 degree, it will be act as a closed circuit that is on state. Now we are going to look about the connections of this tilt sensor. Place the tilt sensor in the breadboard such that the, both the terminals are not shorted. Now we are going to connect power supply to this tilt sensor. Connect the 5 volt power supply to the tilt sensor terminal 1. You can see on the screen, I have connected terminal 1 of the tilt sensor to the power supply given by the Arduino. Now we have to connect a resistor in between terminal 2 of the tilt sensor and the ground of the Arduino. So search for the resistor in the search component given by Tinkercad. I have connected a resistor on the terminal 2. Now let's change the value of resistance that is 220. I have to change the unit that is ohm. Now my resistor is of 220 ohm. Extend this connection of the terminal 2 with resistor to the ground. We are done with the connection of power supply for the tilt sensor. Now how can we get the readings from the tilt sensor? We have to connect a wire from terminal 2 of the tilt sensor to any of the digital pin of given in the Arduino. I have connected my tilt sensor terminal 2 to the digital pin 3 in the Arduino that is PWM pin. So basically we, this wire will help us and act as a voltage divider. Voltage divider is a passive linear circuit that produces an output voltage that is fraction of the given input voltage. For example, right now Arduino is giving 5 volt power supply to the breadboard which is taken by the tilt sensor. Now whenever the tilt is of greater than 10 degree a part of 5 volt will be given to the Arduino board which came to know that this much device is been tilted. Now the circuit for the tilt sensor is over. Now we are going for the coding part. Now we have seen over here that tilt sensor is a sensor so we have to declare a variable for the same. I am declaring variable of tilt sensor. Now I am declaring a variable of tilt sensor that is tilt sensor. Now how we have to take the value from the tilt sensor you can see over here in the variable type there is second block name set tilt sensor 2. I have dragged this block to the coding part. Now how I, how I will get the input from the same so I will click on the input read analog pin A0 or digital pin A0. Here I have selected 
digital pin number 3 so I am going to select this digital 0 pin I have connected this block to digital pin number 3 in the previously added block now I have to change this pin from 0 to 3 as my terminal 2 of the tilt sensor is connected to digital pin number 3 of the Arduino now to get the value given by the tilt sensor I am using a print to serial monitor block given in the output so I have attached this block to the previous code blocks now we have to move to the variables and connect again select the tilt sensor and just paste it to the hello world area now the coding part is over we are going to simulate our project to show the output we are using this serial monitor now clicking on start simulation we can see that our serial monitor is giving zero we can change the value of degree by clicking on tilt sensor now we are gradually increasing the angle of tilt of an object whenever it will be greater than or equal to 10 degree let's see what happens here you can see in the serial monitor that as soon as I have rotated my object to 10 degree it gives me 1 and even if the tilt of an object is greater than 10 degree it also gives 1 so here we came to know about a new component which will be helpful in your task 2 that is tilt sensor thank you